Hello everyone, you are watching College Review Series by Akash. So today we are going to explore ABV IIITM Gwalior, an institute known for its strong academics, placements and branch expertise. Okay, so what if you realize that the branch you enrolled for isn't actually the right fit for you? Can you switch a branch in the middle of a semester? So as we explore IIITM Gwalior, let's also find out how you can pursue the branch that suits you the best. ABV IIITM Gwalior or Atal Bihari Vajpayee Indian Institute of Information Technology and Management is an institute of national importance. The IIITM Gwalior was established in the year 1997 and is located in Gwalior, Madhya Pradesh. The institute was started with an aim to provide professionals in the area of information technology and management. Let's have a look at its wonderful campus. The institute campus is spread over an area of 160 acres amidst the picturesque landscapes in the foothill of the Gwalior. Fort. The campus is a self-contained and equipped with state-of-the-art facilities necessary for the all-round development of students' personalities. It includes the facilities such as library, computer center, laboratories, lecture theatres, sports facilities, hostel accommodation and guest house. So if we talk about the admission process, then the students seeking admission in one of the courses here at Triple ITM Gwalior need to first of all pass class 12 board examination with physics, chemistry and mathematics as their course subject. Secondly, you need to register and appear for JMIN and meet the required cutoff. Thereafter, you need to register for JOSA counselling as the admissions are made through JOSA or CISA counselling. Now, talking about the fee structure. So, here is the consolidated fee structure of different courses available here at IIITM Gwalior. Talking specifically about the BTEC program, so the total fee that includes total institution fee, total hostel fee and hostel mess security deposit comes about to be a total of 1,50,250. Hence, the entire fees for these four years of your BTEC program comes about to be between 9 to 10 lakh. With this, the institute also provides certain tuition fee waivers to its ST, SU, PWD candidates. In addition to this, there are various scholarship schemes available for the students such as National Scholarship Portal, Madhya Pradesh State Scholarship Portal, Merit Kamneen Scholarships and National Overseas Scholarships. And there is other scholarship which is Sherman Foundation USA, providing educational scholarship to its meritorious but economically weaker section students, covering their tuition fee and other institutional charges along with hostel and mess fees. For complete information on scholarship and other details such as the eligibility criteria, do visit the official website. Now let's shift our vision towards the placements at Triple ITM Gwalior. So Triple ITM Gwalior has been showing a strong placement record in the past few years. If you talk about the year 23-24, then total 80 top companies participated in the placement drive. With highest salary package in the domestic category was 65 lakh per annum, whereas the average package stood at 20.56 lakh per annum. The prominent recruiters included Microsoft, Google, Meta, Amazon, Deloitte and Morgan Stanley. Specifically, the Computer Science and Engineering branch received the highest average CTC. Now, here is the big question as how high goes the cutoff? So let's have a look at the cutoff for the year 2024. Here is the branch-wise J main rank cutoff for the year 2024 after fifth round of JOSA counseling. So for Computer Science and Engineering branch, the rank cutoff for gender neutral started at 3,710 and closed at 8,044. For the female-only category, the rank started at 10,050 and closed at 11,529. For electrical and electronics engineering, for general neutral candidates, the opening rank stood at 10,447 and the closing rank was 17,195. For the female only category, the same started at 24,344 and closed at 25,669. For mathematics and scientific computing, the opening rank was 8,643 and closing rank was 11,180 for gender neutral and for female only category the same started at 16057 and closed at 10094 
For integrated BTEC and MTEC in IT sector, the rank for gender neutral category closed at 13,577 and for the female only category closed at 22,022. And for integrated BTEC, IT and MBA program, the rank for gender neutral category closed at 16,856 and for the female only category, it closed at 24,500. 11. For more information on Triple IT Golio for different categories, do visit the link given in the description. Now let's have a look at the vibrant campus life of ABB Triple ITM Golio as quite a few festivals around the year are conducted here at the ISU. Like the cultural event Spect Mackey, it is an endeavor of government of Madhya Pradesh for promoting classical performance art forms like music, dance and drama. Then Aurora, which is a three-day event that comprises of Parivesh, a fashion show, personality contest, Kavi Sammelan, Antakshri, singing competition, dance competitions and similar such events. Further, there are technical events like Infotsav. The institute organizes events that acknowledges technological innovation and management procedures. HIQ, High Intelligent Quotient, which is institute's initiative to encourage innovative knowledge amongst its learners. The other events includes the sporting events, Urja, which is an intra-institute spread over three days during February to March. Then Twaran, which is an inter-triple-ITM athletic meet held around February and March every year. So, coming back to our question now, how hard it is to change your branch or what is the possibility of switching your core branch after the completion of your first and second semester? So the truth is, while it is not easy, it is certainly possible to change the branch if you follow the right approach. As there are some institutes that give you this option of switching branches after the end of first academic year based on your academic performance. Others have probably discontinued this option in order to reduce stress among the students. So one key factor is to maintain a strong CGPA that is above 8 which is being followed at most of the institutes. So talking specifically about ABB, Triple IT and Gwalior, then students do get this option of change of branch after their first year, that is after completion of their first and second semester, providing they meet the specific academic and conduct criteria. In contrast, some IITs such as IIT Madras, IIT Kharagpur and IIT Bombay, they have recently discontinued this option in order to reduce stress among the students. So in case you are unable to switch your branch or unable to get the branch that you desired for, you still can make a career in that branch by by building strong skills beyond your curriculum through online courses, internships and by taking projects that are relevant to the field you want to switch to. Further, you can get into networking. Yes, networking also plays a crucial role, leveraging LinkedIn, alumni connections and participating in coding competitions or hackathons. Now, these activities can also open doors to new opportunities. So, no doubt your branch sets the foundation for you, but your career path is still in your hands. So, what are your thoughts on this? Do let me know in the comment section as this was all from me today. And yes, don't forget to press the like and subscribe button so you do not miss out on any updates. For more such informative content, stay connected.